Rahman Rahim. I start in the name of Allah, the All-Merciful, the Ever-Merciful, and the Everlasting Curse be on the Satan and his followers. Allah's blessings and peace be upon Muhammad the Prophet and upon his pure family. Respected viewers, peace and blessings be upon you wherever you are, and welcome to a new episode of Who's Imam Hussein? In this episode, we will talk about Imam Hussein's sister Zainab, lamentation and grief about her brother. Respected viewers, on the eve of the 10th of Muharram, Al Imam al Hussein had released his companions of the responsibility of facing the army of Yazid under the control of Omar bin Sa'd. However, all of them refused to leave him. Hussein alayhi salam had returned to his tent, as we explained in the previous episode, but one more task remained before morning, comforting his sister Zainab alayhi salam. In a narration from Al Imam al Sajjad, Allah's blessings and peace be upon him, who was ill at that time. He says, On that eve before my father was killed, I was seated with my aunt Zainab alayhi salam, who was caring for me. When Al Hussein left to go to his tent, with him was John, a servant of Abu Dhar al Ghifari alayhi salam, who was preparing the sword for battle. My father was sitting, reciting some verses, saying, Time. Shame on you as a friend. Are the days dawning and the sun setting? How many a companion or seeker will be a corpse? Time will not be satisfied with any substitute. The matter will rest with my mighty one, and every living creature will journey along my path. He, however, respected viewers, repeated this two or three times, said an Imam al Sajjad alayhi salam, who added, I understood it and realized what he meant. Tears choked me, yet I pushed them back. I kept silent and knew that tribulation had come upon us. As for my aunt, she heard what I heard, but she is a woman and weakness and grief are among their qualities. She could not control herself and jumped up, tearing out her clothes and sighing and went to the Imam alayhi salam. I will lose a brother, she said to him. Would that death had deprived me of life today? For my mother Fatima alayhi salam, and my father Ali, and my brother Hassan are all dead. Respected viewers, this is the end of today's episode. Until we meet with a new episode, let's pray that Allah Almighty hasten the reappearance of the master of our time to interpret the message of his grandfather who says, I only desire to spread good values and to prevent evil. Thank you very much indeed for joining us. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.